or they're going to run you over. As we saw, Suarez and Raptor did both sides of that. They stopped it at one point in winner side, and then loser side, they, they kind of got steamrolled by it. And that's bound to happen sometimes with those two players on the... <sighs> All right, so All we're right, gonna start guys. off. <laughs> Buckle <laughs> in, Sora's here. Who's excited? All right, anyway, no. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Devin. Thanks for having my back, dude. I appreciate that. <laughs> All right, now here's the thing. Sora, Sora Spacey's may be definitely a little interesting. I feel like if, if we're gonna talk seriously about yeah. Sora yep. for a quick second, yep. that fair is really annoying. It the is. It's there really too. Annoying. And yeah. his voice, yeah, all annoying. But <laughs> the, I will honestly say that getting the spaces are light and the, the recoveries are predictable, and Sora is very good off stage, so this could be a good pick in terms of edge guarding and, and stealing away stocks from light and tilde. We'll see how he plays in the neutral go against these faster paced characters. But Kiwi and Pelka, that's kind of their game plan, is just to slow it down. That up smash is going to do it off the top there. They got a 2v1. Kiwi, Kiwi very good in the 2v1, but still going to die right there. Getting away tilde, but not light. All right, here we go once again. Tilda just trying to find an option, but I like the way that Pelka didn't throw two Kiwi because he realized that she wasn't necessarily ready. So he's yeah. like, you know what? Give yourself some time. But you got to watch that up B. That sends you actually straight up. Unlike the hero spin with, from Link that sends you out, this one sends you straight up. So it's, it's really dangerous in a game like doubles where, you know, Kiwi may be trying to follow up and then that hero spin comes in and sends you straight oh, up B. just like yep. that. Very yeah. nice. Catching him out of the Blizzaga. Very nice. Tilde and Light not doing too bad, actually, believe it or not. You know, they're actually in the percentage lead right now. So I feel like, you know, they have yeah. been struggling. But once again, we really haven't seen that snake come out. But, you know, Light is all over Kiwi yeah. over there. And like I was saying, too, you got Sora does make sense conceptually in this matchup. The thing is, is I just feel like, and he's a newer character. is the only other problem. Oh, God, Light just reflecting everything. Yep. The thing is, is like he's just not going to be as practiced as the snake yet either. So it's going to take some time. If you really want to commit to and learn a DLC character and play them, you're going to take some lumps first and lose some sets. You might not have, you know, with your main. So maybe they're trying it out. They got one set. They got at least six games to try to make them work. So. I also feel like that reflector is coming into into play. Light is, he is utilizing it. But once again, now I, I got to see Pelka play a little bit more aggressive here, but a little bit more smart. Oh, unfortunately, Clanks with the melon. And he's oh. actually going to be launched off again. I think it's OK to get hit by that melon. It didn't kill. And I think his spacey up smash is just waiting on the other side if he didn't get hit by the melon. So I think it did overall work out. Oh, boy, here we go. Let's see exactly what Pelka can do with this character. But you got to get out of the Tilde oh, right. blender first. Let's and go Tilde. Yeah. Um, I'm saying. I know that from one of the players in our region that he has a really good time of comboing Sora. So he is light. So we'll see what exactly happens here. Tilde just up smash or yeah. up tilt. Oh, see ya. Oh, God. Dunked him in his big dumb shoes. See you later. <laughs> the McDonald's shoes. Yeah. Yeah. Bring him back to Ronald McDonald, wherever you got those. Yeah. So Sora, definitely a good attempt. Okay. Sora was a great attempt in no, my No, it was a good opinion. idea. It was a good idea. No, I, I definitely respect it. I do. The pick, not the character, just to be clear. Yep. Um, makes sense. Now and there, though, edge guard in there. Tilde ready to go. Kiwi, oh, Kiwi's see. picking on. the best tracks, by the way. She's, she's the, the, the fight music. Yeah, this is good. Yeah. This is a good song. I'll give it up. Yeah, we're going to see that, that snake come out. Don't you dare try and get well. that work. I yeah, thought, yeah, yeah, there he is. He hovered Mega Man. I was like, you know what? Why yeah. wouldn't I be surprised? They're right. Yeah, it definitely fits his play style. But either way, we're going to have the snake coming out now. This is what we're waiting for. I think. I honestly think the sword was a good try. Even if you lose the set, you got another one. It might just be snake the whole time. But I just love snake and doubles, too. I think he just caused, I think he's just so, so good in doubles for sure. So we'll see what Sora comes up with later in the meta. But for today, it's going to be the snake for sure. No, I do appreciate how both the green team, they actually just started to do the 1v1 because both of their characters are good at juggling the other characters by the weights. So, you know, wow. Tilde, Tilde having a ball and Light. The edge guarding there was so good. Yeah, Tilde having a ball on one side of the stage and Light is really just taking care of Kiwi on the other side. Well, that and, like, he just waited out the air dodge. He did everything right. Like, the way he threatened Snake with Falco's double jump was just immaculate. And then he got the double dunk on the other side just to clean it up. Very nice. Falco's got uh, Pelka's got to be careful the way he's recovering with Snake, man. He's no Sora. Yeah, Light is really playing so aggressive right now. But there we go. Light realizing, oh, my God, Tilde's in trouble. Hold on. After a little second of brain lag, as I like to call it, just heading oh. on back over to the side of the stage. They're going to separate. They have complete stage control. Has yep. This is looking bad. That's what the green team wants to see for sure. They got full control. Oh, God. Side beam. Oh, God. The forward smash didn't connect. Good tech right there, too. 
But Kiwi dropping that stock, and then here comes Pelka with the retaliation. Very nice. Light has to recover now. Going low. Nice shot by Tilde, clearing some landing space for him. Oh, I thought he was going to go up. I thought for sure he was going up. Yeah, no, he definitely telepathed it. But uh, Pelka, oh my god, just throw himself off stage. That was bold against Light, but you know what? what? He baited him. Why did that, that work? That was the best bait I've ever Why? seen in my life. And unfortunately, Kiwi falling to her death, too. A little messy. What is going on? Yeah, yeah a little this messy. Is, this is wild. Yep. Okay, last stock. One uh -oh. apiece for the yellow team. Dead. Oh my, oh my god. god, 37. That almost. What? Is that forward air? What's going on right yeah, now? Yeah, Pelka unfortunately getting in Kiwi's way there. I feel like she actually had it. But... I think the fortunate thing about this so far is that we know for sure team attack is on. You know, yeah. the rules aren't messed <laughs> up, okay? We all know. All right, here we go once again. The the projectiles, too. We were talking about this a little bit earlier. We thought that, you know, projectiles would just kind of throw off the green team, especially because we felt like they weren't playing as a team a little bit earlier. It has not phased See them it. at oh, all. Oh, he fell out of it? What the heck? Pelka's got the recovery. C4, very nice. With the back air. Edge guarding from Tilde has been pristine. Almost perfect in the matchup. Looking for forward air, too. Oh, oh yeah. They both challenged it. Okay, you're both stubborn, okay? Yeah, they definitely Good challenge that move. Yeah, they definitely are stubborn in a way. Oh my god. Oh, he <laughs> grabbed it! <laughs> There's a handoff right there. Fair, yep. Hydrant. Okay. Kiwi staying alive. Trying to ride the wind bullseye. I like the way that she's always trying to read somebody's jump with back air. That Pac-Man back air is so good, but oh man, Kiwi. Wait! Hold! She wins these? She totally wins these. Maybe. I don't see why not. Yeah, until they oh. not take it. <laughs> All right, like, you enough. got it, bro. You fair got enough, it. Fair enough, fair yeah, enough, fair enough. Till they take in the passenger seat on that one, he realized that, yep. like, Light was completely in position. He was like, hey, do it. You know what I would kind of like to see them do is have Tilde in the lead instead so he can up tilt the scoop at the ledge and then let Light, uh, like, follow up. You know what I mean? Like, it kind of makes more sense to me to let Light, who's more kind of fidgety, yeah. be the guy in the back to react to something. So if they roll and Tilde's up tilting, Light's going to cover that roll every day of the week, but either way. Yeah, but she definitely that got smash. that. Boom, one, two. Mm -hmm. Thanks a lot, Light. Really appreciate it. You watching my backlight? Uh, yep, yeah, watching <laughs> it. It's gone. See you. Yeah. Once again, Kiwi, totally, perfectly capable of taking a 2v1. She is. If you don't know her, she's one of the best in doubles, for sure. Yeah, very strong doubles presence. Has been for a long time. Oh, long, oh now long the time. other Kingdom Hearts song. Aren't you just so happy, Hazel? You know, they left off a lot of good ones, though. That's like Rising, true. Rising Tension, why is that not in there? True. See? Is that? That's not owned by Stop Disney. Stop that. Oh, really? Wow. Well, that makes sense. Oh, well. The rising Tension is King of too. Thanks, Disney. Oh, he's back. Aren't you so excited? Well, here he is. Now, why do you think they went back to this? What, the team? Yeah, why do you think I they think, went I back think to this? I think Edge Guards forced him off the snake. I think that was it. Yep. And, and if you lose this set, you might just want to be collecting data at this point. Oh, that forward smash. That was, oh, boy. Yeah, I love the way that Sora is actually able to react out of that um, hero spin, the up B. Once again, it's just super, super tricky. But a lot of the times that is very punishable. I feel like I've seen a lot of Sora so far use all three. You don't necessarily have to use all three of yeah. the side Bs there. You do so have some mix with the side B. You can either fly at your opponent, the homing, or you can go in any of the, the typical directions. But there you go. Light off the stage. See you later. Yeah, Early light. lead here for the for the green or yellow team. Yeah, no, for sure. Also, Light was also trying to go for that trampoline, but unfortunately, the hitbox from the Firefox actually got rid of the trampoline, so he didn't actually get the ride. So, once again, Tilde evening things up on the other side of the stage and he's going to be that stock tank once again he's just been doing such a good job of playing neutral with both these players letting light kind of shine on one side of the stage and then kind of distracting the other player oh Ooh. my god he's doing that a lot he goes up there he just charges the down so oh did he get that up b man if that killed that was a clip for sure that's what we want to see off the green team those follow-ups the awareness oh look for the back air too let's find it I also like the way that Pelka actually stalled off stage, trying to get uh, like one two of the fair, one two of the nair to try and like combo him off. But Kiwi gonna answer with an F smash. He's like, I've got enough. <laughs> yeah, it's time. It's time to end it. Oh, okay, here we go. Oh, the shine. She got two. Oh, see you later. He stole it. Yep, very nice. <laughs> that was so and, mean. Well, that and like he did the. He's Fox, so he's super fast well to take it. Like that was really good. And have the confidence to go down there when you can't see the trampoline and be like, yeah, I got this. Like I'm, I'm gonna hit it anyway. That was really nice by Light. Great edge guard. One thing I do want to point out as well is that um, for people that don't know, when Sora's uh, Thundaga actually gets reflected, it goes actually straight up. So it doesn't oh, yeah, like yeah, yeah. go like opposite direction. It actually goes straight up. So we saw that before from Light. Now, you got to watch that, though, because if Tilde is there and he's jumping, you're definitely going to get hit by that. So once again, looking so much better between the green team from what we've seen practically all day. Tilde sharking for something, but Pelka's coming in with that spin saying, hey, get away from her. 
go. Light got to make his way back here. Tilde in the 2v1. Okay, gets a back air. Light's going to try to edge guard here. Oh, the down air. Oh, back air. See ya. That was a combo, actually. If he attacked, obviously, would have changed it up. But nice job by Tilde again. Tilde off stage. Definitely one of the MVPs for the green team. That was a quick 30. That was a quick 30. <laughs> wow. And yeah, no, we were saying this about the yellow team is that they're going to try to create some space, or yeah. run down the clock a little bit, try to create some, you know, run out the time. Definitely Not very happening. surprising. Yeah, no, for sure. Once again, we only saw strong gameplay from yellow team all day. Yeah, it's like, true. We really hadn't seen them struggle with anything. So it's kind of surprising now to kind of see them just fall so easily to a team like Tilde Light, where they haven't seen before. So once again, just up smashes, trading. Oh, you know what? I'm down for this team. Yeah. I like it. Yeah, I you actually like this a lot more. C4 and up throw. Yep. Works with Meta Knight, works with Kirby. We'll see what happens. You guys can't see the screen, but it's going to be Kiwi's Kirby, who is her definitely se her first secondary, for sure. She plays her a couple. brawl main, too. Yeah, and yep, one of her brawl mains, for sure, yeah. Oh, no, she it down. Uh, They're going for quad grenade. Uh, we, we said it, Lyric. They got to slow the game down. They're doing just that. Better than two snakes. It's be snake and a Kirby. Throw out the grenades. All right. I feel like now she's going to actually go for that air to air a little bit more with Tilde because Kirby aerials are deceptive. They're good. Strong. They're really yeah, good. Especially that back air. So once again, she's going to definitely have a little bit more presence on this Kirby if she plays it a little bit right. So once again, we're going to see Light kind of jump on the other side of Sage. Tilde already sitting at 103, 30 seconds in. I think, I think Kirby 2 is a, a character that really uh, does a lot better in the doubles format because Typically, the counterplay to Kirby is just to camp him out all day and just like he's, he's kind of stubby and slow, like you can't do anything. But in doubles, there's a lot more close quarter combat. So, especially against this green team, like they're definitely closing the gap a lot. So, having the Kirby to threaten that could be a good thing. And so far, it's working, especially because you get the grenade. And look at that, the green team dropping the first stock, looking for down angle forward smash, can't find it. Oh, okay, late. Yeah, no, but yellow team also was in position for the first time. They've definitely practiced this. Uh, Kiwi sitting on the ledge. Hulk is sitting on the platform, so they were perfectly sandwiched right there. Now, stocks are still even. Unfortunately, Kiwi going to drop hers. That's the definition of commentary curse, fortunately. But now stocks are even again. Dead even now. Yep. I mean, this yellow team, I like the adjustment. I think it did need some some sort of change. It wasn't the sword. It wasn't the snake. But it looks like it might be the Kirby on it, which is crazy because, like, I didn't think the Pac-Man was doing fine, obviously. But Kirby's just a wild card in this, in this situation. Here we go. Both of them are, you know, off stage currently right now. Gonna get be able to get the fair off there. Kurt, uh, Kiwi back on stage. Wow, and that was a little team combo themselves. Look at it, off of the nair right into the up tilt. I'm telling you, this Kirby's brawling it up. Kiwi really smart there as well. She tried to uh, recognize that Tilted was gonna come down with a down air, but good coverage by Pelka. Stock's looking super even at this point. So now we're gonna go back to this 1v1 situation and Tilde's gonna win that every time. Oh, nice, get out of there. Yeah, I like that. You check your teammate out of the way. That was nice. Oh, hold on, got an edge guard situation though. He's going for the, Kiwi going for the down air, can't find it. Light able to recover too. I like that Light, he held his jump too. It's such an important thing to do as a spacey against Kirby because he can, if you don't have your jump, he might just down air you and kill you. So nice job by Light. Good matchup awareness. Light just kind of having his way on the other side of the stage. Yep. Pelka, gonna try and kind of sandwich them in together, but once again, Light just in the air is such a menace. Yeah. Dude. These, oh, yeah. these up airs are so brutal. So fast. Yeah. And I like also the way how he's jumping from platform to ledge, just to kind of wait for <laughs> Tilde to get a little bit more comfortable on stage. He doesn't really feel comfortable starting something without him. Low, look at Light running up and grabbing. So again, utilizing that speed that Fox has, trying to create some space for his partner Falco. Lasers coming out though, doing a good job interrupting these grenades. Protecting, he's saying, you know, even if Tilde dies here, we get the stock lead, hold on. Can we make it back? It's gonna be low, that's it. Yeah, no, couldn't make it back. It's gonna be Light. Oh, actually, it's gonna be 2v1 again. Let, let Tilde take the, oh, Tilde's so good at this. Yep, see ya, that's it. Yep, <laughs> Tilde, yep. He is so good at edge guarding Snake, he really is. He He's knows already where seen you're it. going every time. Well, I think the, the big hop from Falco is so good at it, and for the positioning, you could scare him into air dodging early, or c 4 or doing something, but the big hops from Falco and Tilde's positioning are just so good, look at this. Whoop, jump, which way are you gonna go? Yeah, all right, nice oh. there, see ya. Q. Oosh. Yep, easy. That's just the positioning. And the way he's facing backwards, too, still able to hit the dare, but also could line up an easy back air as well. So, nice job by Tilde. I'm telling you, edge guard. It, don't quote me on this chat. It might be Sora. It might be Sora Kirby that we need. It might be Sora Kirby. What makes you say that? I want to be a good Snake's co dying. Snake's dying. I, they're Snake, both dying, Snake's, unfortunately. Snake, Snake can't live. That's usually a Falco. That's usually a Pelka does. I'm I think sure. they think. I think they're talking about it. To be honest with you. No, she said, was shaking her head. I'm, she knows. I, no, I told you. They are talking about it. She said no. <laughs> She's like, like uh, nah, nah. I'm good. But the thing is, is 
I'm uh, down for Tortimer Island, 100%. We see them hovering Tortimer Island. Yeah, go to small battlefield. Yeah. Kiwi DJ? Oh, regular battlefield. You know right, what? Let's get a this good is song. also a pick. What, what do you think about regular books? battlefield? Yes, that's Edge of Dawn. I think um, I, every time this team makes an adjustment, they, Kirby. Snake Kirby. I like Snake Kirby. That's probably, the, honestly, probably the best chance right there. But, and I think the time to gamble is over. Like, you got to start winning games. You know what I mean? And I think they found that the Kirby can be effective. I think they just need to be careful and not let it get down to that last situation where until they can get the edge guards on Snake. But that's a problem with Kirby. He can't move very much. So I think the smaller stage of Battlefield, Kirby can cover more distance quicker. So I think that'll help out. We'll see. We just don't want this to happen <laughs> where Light is just comboing Pelka. All right, here we go, though. I, I really like the first interaction I saw from Kiwi and uh, Til Tilde on the other side of the street. Other side of the stage. And once again, we're going to see Pelka kind of sit right under that platform. I feel like this is a, such an amazing pick for them. I feel like this is definitely a really smart pick. They almost had him sandwiched right there, Hasman. Mm -hmm. Off stage, though. Kiwi's so slow to get back. Look at now Pelka's getting it up oh, exactly where we didn't want him to be. I like the, the ambiguous recovery there, hiding not in the blast zone, so you can't see the magnifying glass. It's really nice. Up, up air from light, almost taking it down, too. They want a little more survivability, too, on the Kirby. So B Battlefield, getting those blast zones extended out is going to help out there, too. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, no, that's light. He's not going to jump into that. Oh. Got to watch that. Tilde just playing a little bit more passive. Nice nair from, from uh, Kiwi, too. Yep. Most nairs in this game are, like, really good combo breaks where they kind of just, like, trip you up just a little bit. I also think about that with, like, K rules nair since it's so big and extends. Ooh. But, whew, sheesh. Stock's going down. They're going all over the place right now. Pelka at 150. This is what the yellow team needed is for Pelka to live longer, and now he still is holding on to his first stock here. Kiwi trying to create some space. Oh, boy. Too much chaos. I like that. Kiwi just got in the mix. She's like, I might take some hits, but as long as Pelka's holding on to his stock, I'm feeling good. Yeah, that no. is truly their key to victory is Pelka living a long time. Back air from light, though, going to clear out the first one. The thing is, though, because Kiwi is on Kirby, she's going to die a little bit sooner to some of those box up smashes. Yeah. So yep. once again, Tilde is not shy from doing that. And, or, Light is not shy from doing that. Ooh. Tilde is not shy from Ooh, getting a back God. air. That's, what I, that's where I was going. Yeah. Uh, but once again, it's just so much chaos on this stage. Once again, a little bit smaller. Definitely has been working out for the yellow team. I feel like green team hasn't been able to find their footing at all yet so far. They haven't been able to kind of separate and conquer. Go up airs a couple times. Go to the landing, all right. Kiwi again here, she's got a situation. Go for the 2v1, trying to help her teammate out. He needs it too. Only has a Cypher left. Oh, he gets a C4 kill and a recovery. The awareness from Pelka, or he's just a snake player and he thought he needed C4. But either way, got the kill. Doesn't matter how he got it. He's got to watch it though. Oh. oh my god, because that a minute, C4 wait a minute. helped him out so much. Light, fishing for something, not going to be able to find it. But once again, he has got to watch out. At this point, she is sitting pretty, you know, in the middle of everything, she's taking a lot of hits, and Light knows exactly when to go for her, and that's, like, right now. Yeah. I think this is, honestly, I think if Yellow Team doesn't take this game, it's going to be the set. I mean, a reverse 30 is going to be really tough to pull against this green team on their own counter pick, so I think they need to make it work right here, right now. Trying to edge guard here. Kiwi trying to set something up. Here comes here comes the green team, though. The aerial assault. We've seen it all day, Lyric. It's been so good, and they're trying to close it out now with this. Oh, looking for the cross-up back air. Good air dodge by Pelka. He's still in disadvantage, though, Lyric. All right, here we go. Up smash oh. by Light, not exactly going to oh. take it. Both green team members launched up into the blast zone, not going to be able to find anything on that platform. Pelka has placed that C4 on top plat this entire time. He knows that Light oh. wants to go up there. He knows that spaces are baiting up, up tilt or up smash on there. Well, and now it's all up to Kiwi for this game. Number two, five. 2v1 is Kirby. It's going to be tough. Nair off stage. Let it recover here. Creating some space with the fair. Using all the jumps there and the up B. No legend vulnerability. Yeah, parry, up smash, nice. It, it, it covered on top of uh, him, actually, too. I like the idea to cross up there from Kiwi. It just didn't work out for her. That box up smash, such a strong move. Such a good hitbox on it. Yeah, you can see. Using all our jumps, ready, one. Yeah, you were talking about this a little bit earlier. Tilde has chosen to take the passive back every single time. Yeah, that's not, I, I think it's interesting. I mean, obviously, Light is a phenomenal edge guard or two, but just the character build, I, I think Falco should be taking point, honestly, and then let Light try to react. Because you get by Tilde, Fox is a little more fidgety. Like, he can react and, and get better punishes. So just just in my opinion, not that Tilde's not doing a good job or whatever, but I think it suits the character strengths a little bit better. So that's just IMO. I'm going to stick it with the Kirby. Oh, I thought we were about to see the Light Pichu. Please, no. I thought he was going to go Sora, which would actually be disappointing. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Battlefield is going to be the last pick once again. Uh, 
gotta see though, Yellow Team really has to pull together. They definitely have something right here with the size of the stage. It was definitely helping them a yeah. little bit earlier. But now they gotta figure out how Kirby kind of mixes in here. They're playing, you know, he was just trying to kind of follow up on everything, and I don't think anything's home. So far, Palka just eating so much damage off the top. Yeah, and I think that, you know, the more that this team worked on the strategy, the more that they learned, the better the solution has gotten, right? Like, I do think this is, I agree with you, I do think that this is their best counter pick stage and characters. I think it's working out the best so far. They just need to close out this game. And I think the key thing, obviously, is just getting it down to the 2v1 on their side before the opponents can. These edge guards though against Snake. Oh my god, the up air. That's so good. The Nair scooping, yeah. Nair wouldn't have killed, but the the up, up air does, oh, that's the, all right, well, wrong guy, but you know, whatever. <laughs> uh, love the effort. Yeah, the, your heart was in the right place, as True. you could say. Mm -hmm. Once again, yeah, oh my God, trying to good find, awesome, him. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Memories of my little league just came back to me. True. <laughs> anyway, um, once again, Light oh. just trying oh. to find an edge guard oh. off. Tilde just having a blast over there with Pelka. Really, it's just the spacing here. Yeah, okay. Kiwi the situation here though, could go for an edge guard, saving the double jump. Oh, she's got both of them off stage now too. The Kita coming in for support and it hits Kirby. And that's a dead fox though, so all right. The yellow team needed that one. Yeah, for sure. Evening things up now, but once again, this this separation kind of tactic that green yep. team has had, it's it's working for them really, really well. And even, oh my god, he was able to combo yeah. fair off of Nair there? That was kind of kind of nasty. It's, it's the isolation, you know what I mean? Man on man. Nice. Going for the up tilt didn't work. But the thing is, because they're both really slow characters, right? Fighting against Snake and Kirby, it's like, yeah, the isolation is going to go in favor of the green team. They're going to go for that all day. But when the green, when the yellow team can't help each other out, it helps out a lot. And I really do. Oh, like, God. Oh my uh, God. Everyone, who didn't die there? Uh, okay. Just yeah. Light and Kiwi. Just oh, kidding. There goes Kiwi. Just yep, just light. Yep. Just <laughs> um, Paris Ramirez Garcia. That's Super true. Super Smash Con champion. <laughs> anyway, it's I true. do like how they are. <laughs> This is you could call him that because you know him, That's his right? government. <laughs> yeah, I could call him Smash Con Champion. <laughs> Paris Ramirez Garcia, Super Smash Con Champion, 2021 Fall Fest. I really do like the way that the Spaceys are trying to play around that top platform. Yep. They know, they realize when C4 is not there, it's definitely their best ally. But Kiwi going to be able to even things up and really... The player here is like, oh no, with that shield break. And unfortunately, he's going to fall to his death. And it's up to Kiwi once again. Now, this All is right. possible with two spaces, but once again, Light uh, is just looking for one of those aerials. Going for the, oh, the inhale. The chew okay. dad. <laughs> chew now, dad that's flashbacks that. right there. Yeah, yeah he did. Yep. I definitely aged the Kiwi, myself. The Kiwi with the chew dad. <laughs> that's so funny. Up, oh, see ya. Oh, game. Yep, freeze frame right there. 6 0. -oh. I think Fox was. C posing, that was weird. But either way, yep, 6-0. Oh, uh, yep, big hug from Light They definitely Light cleaned that up. Yeah, I they felt did, like that yeah. was a little bit of a journey for them. I felt like, yeah. you know, it wasn't as clean in the beginning, but they definitely cleaned that up. It was it was getting a little sticky until <laughs> they, they turned. That told you it was a T pose right there. You see that? Yep. And they, they earned it too, because there were a lot of really good teams. I mean, they even lost to Suarez uh, and Raptor earlier in the bracket, who also, they got, Suarez and Raptor got blown up by that team right there. Oh, the zoom in on the hug. Wait, now we gotta, no, wait, now we gotta start singles though. So we're done, that's it. The hug is the last sign of friendship we'll see from them today. We just uh, do have bit, a yeah. quick ad break before oh, we, we go on ahead Let's and switch it on over to, I believe it's Dara and AG, I wanna say, I think okay. so.